Hi everyone. I am Myra McFadden and I am so glad to be with you for this upcoming class, Spiritual Counseling Practices 502. It's going to be a wonderful time as we deepen from spiritual counseling theory and we move forward into a deeper understanding of different theory um, models, different kinds of practices, and as we practice, as we practice spiritual counseling with one another. Now, I imagine that I will know most of you from theory class, but I also understand there may be some new students that are picking up and joining with us here. And so whether I've met you before and gotten to know you from the previous class, or whether you are new to me, I just really want to say welcome. One of the things that we will be doing is we will be focusing with greater depth and greater application into the four counseling theories that we started. We will be moving more fully into, of course, Rogerian, client-centered. We will also be delving a little more deeply into brief solution-focused, the ABCDE model that we used from Kleinbell. We also will be looking at narrative therapy more fully, and we will also be engaging Gestalt therapy even more fully. I am so excited. I think these different therapy models are perfect for spiritual counseling, and we will deepen in them and in our practice and in our understanding. Well, one of the greatest things that we do with spiritual counseling practice is we always engage the activity and the presence of God. And so I'd like to go ahead and begin by sharing a welcome meditation with you now. I invite you to just close your eyes right where you are. And as you do, simply take this moment to relax your body. Loosen up your shoulders. Relax any lines or any tension in your face. And allow your body to simply be fully supported by the seat beneath you. It feels good to relax, to let go, to simply be present to this moment. And as we allow our bodies to relax, let us take our inner focus and turn it toward our breath. Perhaps you place your hands on your stomach. Perhaps you put a hand on your heart center and on your stomach, your solar plexus. And you simply feel the presence of breath within your being with its gentle movement in and out, in and out. With each breath, you slow down the busyness of your mind and you become present to the activity, the power of peace within your being. Gentle peace moving through your body, through your breath gentle peace as you let go into this moment. Perhaps you can hear the sound of the water from my water fountain here in my office. And if you can, Allow the sound of the water to bring forward any healing you may desire. Allow the sound of the water to remind you of the purity within your soul.
may it remind you of the cleansing presence of spirit within you. Simply feeling your breath, hearing the sound of the water, you are reminded of the truth. You are one in God. And as we allow this awareness to fill our beings, I invite you to imagine the class ahead. I invite you to imagine your classmates and myself with you on our Tuesday nights. Imagine spending time together, growing and learning together, stretching, expanding, loving, and understanding one another and spiritual counseling even more fully. Our time together is brought by spirit. It is the divine appointment and each and every one of us is significant. Each and every one of us is important in this process. We all have things to learn. We all have ways to grow. We all have ways to listen and to speak. And so we hold each other in the light right here and right now, creating the space ahead for spirit to be present, to know that each and every one of us is important and already valued. Thank you. Thank you, God, for this class. Thank you for each and every one of us. Thank you for the wisdom, the understanding, the compassion, and the growth and skills that we will share together. Thank you, thank you, God. And so it is. Amen. And now let us open our eyes and imagine that we can see one another as we look forward to our time together. Thank you so much and namaste.